Are these trees? The trees are totally different. There wasn't trees here. Um, I believe there was a path going this way and that way. That is no longer there. We have a house right next to the castle, which I'm actually really surprised by. So maybe this would have been servants' quarters, like pre. Uh, silver Glade days. Maybe. Cause that's really close to a castle. Um. So I see what they did. So they changed to where the roads actually went. The roads split off from this way and that way. And they used to be more up here, I think, where that house is and where the rock is. That, and it also wasn't clearly defined before. So I went straight through the city. Which is kind of weird, because it's kind of hard to go straight through the city like I did in the before video. Because I don't think this is nearly as much as a street as there should have been before. So they do kind of have the circle, although the circle's different. Um, let's see. I surprisingly didn't see the clock tower. That was not the first thing that I saw. I thought they were making that so it would be easier to see, but it doesn't look to be. So this is now the mail guy. He now has his own building, so I guess it's the post office. This building is a something. This guy has a saddlery, so he's probably, this is probably like your general store. This is probably a house based on the mailboxes, or mailbox, or a business. Uh, these are, s this is hairdresser. So our clothing shop's here. Did they all get an update? I didn't really pay that much attention to that. This is all pretty cool. Probably is a house or an apartment complex. <gasps> Look at this, guys. Look at this. Down here. Down here. It looks to be a schoolhouse. Is this a schoolhouse? They definitely didn't have this before. You can even sit on them, it looks like. Got a sandbox. I wonder if you could play with that. That would have been really cool if you could have played with that. We've got that. It, that's a cute little schoolhouse. It's a big schoolhouse. But it's cute. I don't want to run into anything. I'm assuming those are mailboxes. Alright, so... We also had a before and after. Looking at... Championship. Okay, so the championship has added... 
these two houses. Oh, there's a third one back there. That looks like someone's house with a car. Someone's got laundry. It's a blowing in the wind laundry. That's pretty cool. That's a nice little touch. Um, I like the fact that there's all kinds of laundry. What's up here? This is... That's probably going to be something later on. Oh, no, wait. It's a tailor. Ah, the tailor has his own tailor shop. Okay, that makes sense. Alright. I think I saw Big Bonnie. Big Bonnie must be up here. What is this stone formation? This stone formation is really cool. Can you sit on the stone? Hold on. Can you sit on the stone formation? Oh, I wish you could, because that would actually be really cool to be able to do. Yeah. Oh, there's the old tree. So they didn't take that away. That's nice. Oh, they've even got a nice um, bird's nest in it. I saw a crazy house. Where's a crazy house? Where'd it go? Must be where this big road is. Alright, so this is Big Bonnie's house. That is pretty cool. I'm assuming that is a windmill. <coughs> that guy looks creepier than ever. You also can't get very close to it, apparently. It's really cool. I like her gears. The steampunk vibe is very, very real. I should have worn steampunk for today. Alright. Where had I not been yet? The fountain is new. I can't tell you if it's in the exact same location or not, though. Oh, it's got petals coming down. That's pretty. This is a shared backyard, I guess. Pretty, pretty tree. I like how the vines are growing up that house. It's actually really cool. Now, who exactly are you? You're the vet. That makes sense. Okay. So I wonder, did they update anything? Hot potatoes. Oh, it's still the same old equipment. Doesn't look like there's anything new in that. Now I'm curious to see if they've changed anything about the uh, club room. Nope, that's not what I wanted. They did not change the club room. And it's also the Enchanted Tree Legion, so they have not done anything with this place at all. Which, you would think that this would be something that they would have done, mainly because it is part of Silver Glade Village. And that's exactly what just got updated today. So this is kind of like a major oversight, because this is Silver Glade Village. <laughs> but... It shall be interesting. 
to really see how things go because um, the st I, I'm a little confused by the style of the buildings. That could just be me, though. I guess they, they kind of remind me of what you would find somewhere near water. Like, like a port city. And maybe that's just me not being anywhere other than the U.S. And seeing houses like this really on the port cities. Mainly in the colors and the shapes and styles. Like if you've ever seen some of the old um, movies and stuff like that. Um, I would say the most unique has definitely got to be Big Bonnie's. The rest of it kind of looks like what I would assume a, a mixture between like a Victorian uh, cottage and like a cottage bay that you'd see. Kind of like in Maine or something like that. But... I don't know, I feel like I'm walking through Haven, if you've ever seen that show. That's kind of like what I feel like I'm walking through. Just building wise. So all in all, I mean, it, it's definitely pretty. Um, like flowers. Flowers are a nice touch. It'll be a bit confusing getting used to where everybody is, but since I'm so far into the game, I don't really have to worry too much about where somebody is anymore. But yeah, um, this looks pretty nice. How far does how far did they change the tree structures? They have actually done a lot more. They did quite a bit, actually. Hold on. This pasture's new. So they... Okay. So they updated Silverglade and added everything new all the way around it, except for changing anything about Steve's farm. Steve's farm really looks bad compared to the area. In fact, I almost would say Steve's farm needs to be picked up and moved probably another... Well, I don't know. Steve's farm should be way over where that silo is. Okay, it's two. So Silverglade now also moves out over here to Marley. Which... I also kind of feel like maybe they could move them move him just a little bit but he's at least nestled in kind of like a canyon so I think he might actually be okay but I would still love to see him updated I hope when they do updates they don't get rid of the white trees because biodiversity in trees is so very important and it does look like they gave us some some of these, which is good. I like the updated version. But yeah, even in the town, I can barely see the clock tower. So, I think the clock tower needed to be moved up way more, if you were actually wanting to be able to see it from a distance. But, I think that's really all that I have to say about any of this. I mean, it's a really good update. It just, it really highlights, though, how much more the area needs to be updated. So hopefully this is going to be their next goal for updates because it really looks out of place right next to this. That's why I'm kind of confused why they wouldn't have updated this and this at the same time. Because it this really looks out of place and it really shows the difference between the new and the old. Maybe I'm just being a little too persnickety. This 
was actually a really pretty update, and it's going to take some time getting used to it. But I look forward to getting used to it. <laughs>